Hey guys, what's going on? Uh, this is Boy Mesma. That is Keegan there. He might be talking throughout the video. Um, David won't be because he is a derp and never talks on his mic unless it's like after 6 o'clock. <laughs> and then he usually logs off anyway. But yeah. Okay, so I'm going to teach you um, how to record gameplay, live gameplay, and. Um, well, not record, um, live stream it to Twitch TV or Justin TV. So, so first things first, let's just open up the internet and just go exhibit.com. So, we'll just go to their website, um, <coughs> just register. So, you type in your email address, all that kind of stuff. Um, yeah, and then you just click on this download. Um, you can download the beta if you want. Um, I've just got the the version one because uh, that worked better for me. I found so once you've once you've downloaded it, then you can just uh, come back to this step here, which is uh, opening it and hopefully it working for you. So um so yeah, you just put in your email address that you signed up for XSplit on their website for and your password that you chose. So you just log in and you just wait for that to um, load up. So. Usually takes a little while to load up. I mean, my computer is pretty good with uh, speed-wise, and uh, yeah. So, so just wait for this to kind of load up. Maybe sing a song while you're doing it. Listen to some music. Listen to Keegan in the back. Okay, so um, it ju it just changed my screen because I run my Windows in Aero mode, so it is, it's just going to ask you if you're running it in a different mode. Um, blah blah blah. Yes, I don't care. Stuff like that. So now you just have to wait for this one to wait, 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 wait. Yep. Bam. Close. Okay, so sometimes it might come up with um like it already there because um, pretty much what you want to do is just go file new presentation now it'll come up with this message here don't worry about that that much you just want to uh, go up to your broadcast and go edit channels so here we are now um, add if you're streaming to Justin TV or Twitch TV you just click this one here and you type in your username, so mine's Mesma. And no, I will not accept you. Yeah, and that'll pretty much automatically connect to your username and your channel. So it does that. Now, location, um, I'm in Australia, so it doesn't matter. But if you're in Europe or America, yeah, sure, we'll go ahead and change that to wherever. Um, preset, I didn't even change, but um, the quality. Um, I changed to 10 because it makes me feel better about myself. Um, I put that up to 1,000 and um, that up to 1,500. A good way to um, get a um, get your knowledge of your bitrate is to just go to um, go to speedtest.net and just wait for that to load up. So this this will show you your ping, um, your download speed. Mine's kind of up around the kind of 17, 18 megabits. So there's 17.96. Now this is really important to point out. This is megabits per second, not megabytes. Megabytes and megabits are completely different. So megabits are a, um, a larger unit. So what you have to do is just just check your just check whichever speed you got. So I got 17.96. So just type in 17.96 in this website, and it's about um, two and a quarter. So um, megabit, megabytes per second. So yeah. So 2.45, 2.245 um, megabytes per second there. And the upload speed that is again in megabits. So that's 0.85. Um, I've found that it doesn't actually really matter that much about your upload speed because I, I've seemed to be streaming it in um, fairly high quality and it's been fine. Like I haven't found that um, the internet's lagging at all or anything like that. So 
people that are like, um, yeah, well, it does kind of matter about this, just just be like, yeah, well, this guy said otherwise because he's awesome. So, yep. So, yeah, you just pretty much type in here. I just used a thousand, so just use a thousand if you like. Um, I just pretty much just went random and just went, oh, yeah, a thousand would be all right. Um, the buffer rates, um, you want to put to about 1,500, so I've already done this by myself, so I'm not going to save this, but all you have to do is just press OK when that's done. I didn't change any of the audio encoding, so I'm just going to leave that. And then it, it should come up with your screen, um, well, your your account, your channel that you've that you made uh, at Twitch TV, so there that is. Then what you want to do is change your resolution. It should be automatically put on to 640 by 360. Um, what you want to do is just, if you if you want, uh, this is better, this is how I, this is HD TV, 720p, just click that one. Now, I freaked out the first time it did this because it, it stretched all the way out to my screen. I'm like, hey, what's going on? So I just went view and go scale viewport, put it down to 50%, which is back to normal pretty much. So your frame rate, you want to be around 24, 25. So yeah, that's all. That's all fine. Um, another quick thing, you could go into your general settings and check your um, <coughs> your mics and stuff like that. Um, should all be fine. So yeah. Okay. Now, moving on to the game part. I don't know if you can see, but um, I'm using Heroes of Newith, which is a uh, kind of Dota-style game. So, what you want to do here is, if you can see this, um, it's because it's running in um, Windows mode. I've just unchecked this box right here, and it's changed it to Windows mode. So, it now runs in Windows. So Now, once that's done, all you have to do is go to this and go Add Screen Region. So you just click on that, just click the top left hand corner, just kind of look for that and drag it out. So now it's kind of cropped down to this, this size here, so you could leave it at that, but um, what you want to do is just go just uncheck that box so it stretches out to the full width. Um, now you can see here how it has these um, borders, so a quick way to get rid of them uh, is top to 20, left about 4, bottom 4, and right 4, so that's done, um, I don't really need to change anything else about that, just pull that back up, and now as soon as you're ready to broadcast, you've got everything set up, you're in, um, you're, you're waiting for the game, you can just alt tab to back to XSplit and just press the board broadcast and that'll just start streaming now so so there we are so I'm just gonna leave this for a few seconds um, it's gonna it's gonna start start recording by itself so I'm just gonna log in and then I'm just gonna alt tab back to my desktop and go to my twitch TV so so we can see here um, Bam Docs Rune, people, stuff, if if it does show you. So you just want to go Twitch TV, oops, slash Mesmer. Okay, so this is my, pretty much my broadcasting website, so. So my broadcasting do, 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 do. website. So, so you can kind of hear me in the background now. Again, that means that works. So my you can see the quality do, do, do. right here, and as you can Where see, you it know? looks pretty so good, and it's streaming with now, no again. problems. So that means that works. But um, if you do check your live stream, just just be prepared to um, figure that it loops sound when you're recording and you're saying it at the same time. So, yep. Um, guys, thank you for watching, and uh, I will be doing more tutorials if you need me to. Ask me questions. Um, I don't know if Keegan's still in the call. Keegan, are you there? Yes, hello. Yes. Um, um, if he's got any questions, he can ask me. Do you have any questions, Keegan?
Okay, so 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 you go to. I'll just stop broadcasting because it's broadcasting. So I'll just stop that. You you go. You click on broadcast, and you go edit channels. Come into channels. Um, you'll you'll see that there'll be an ad on the right side. Um, and then you just click that, and it'll say which which one you are. So you go to Twitch TV. And you yeah. click on that, and it'll come up with a little box. And then you put in your username that you use for Twitch TV. So mine is Mesma. So you just spell that fine and everything. And once you've done that, it'll automatically put in channel your channel name. So, and then. You pretty much just leave everything the way it is and just press OK. So that's it for that one. Cool. Thank, thank you. That's all right. I get it. <coughs> all right, guys. Um, yeah. So just stay tuned if you need any more help with anything to do with um recording gameplay of um other video games, anything like that. So yeah. Thanks for watching, and this is uh Mesmer. See you later.